Hello you all, happy people, hope you guys are doing great. All right, today, one of the travel log, uh, I'm here uh, at the shooting range. It's quite close to my house. It's called uh, Guthrie's. And uh, today I'm gonna show you guys around Guthrie's, which is very nice, which is very close and which is in the middle of uh, Midrand. And uh, the staff is nice, you got uh, archery range and you got a shooting range let's see how it goes got my mask on thank you So you can buy your equipment and everything over here. That's where you can find. Hello, oh, mate. How are you? I'm good, and you? Good. There's certain rules that you need to follow. Make sure that uh, you fill in all the information. This range is quite secure. <laughs> There's the MP5. Got a couple of AK 47s. Some more rifles at the back. Here's the Lieber Actions 0.22. Um, that's called an H5 an AR 15. And some other bolt action rifles. And then on this door we have some of the revolvers. The big one here is a 44 Magnum with a scope. And then on this door, all the different pistols. You got the Glocks, um, some of the CZs. But a Colt 45, and then just some other random stuff. Yeah. So that's pretty much the, the guns we have. Hello, Mr. Gordon. How are you? Doing? How are you? Good, thank you. Good. That's a big boss. <laughs> this is the big boss, the one which we just seen him. And he's got a gold in 1992 and the archery. All this other thing. And this is the archery range. And that's where his switcher is training. All in all. And that's the senior coach. No. And that's a junior coach, Ryan. All right, guys, uh, I've got Noel Robinson here. Uh, he's a coach for uh, Switcher. Uh, hi, Noel, how are you? Yeah, thanks, Shay. Thanks for having me on board. Um, yeah, archery, it's a wonderful journey. Please uh, come and experience it with us here at Guthrie's uh, shooting range in Midrand. Um, we act, uh, we active on a Saturday but from 11 o'clock to 5 o'clock and uh, no bookings but you can get my number from Shay and uh, just WhatsApp but yeah c please come in and enjoy the experience at whatever level you want to it's uh, for some people it's uh, just for re re relaxation rest and relaxation for others it's they want to get to the next whatever it is Olympics or whatever they've seen it on TV and for others, sometimes it's, uh, it's uh, the way of the bow is a spiritual pursuit, as it is in Zen archery. 
So whatever you want to do, whether you want to start off hunting or you want to just do it for recreation or for target competitions or for spiritual, it's all of the above and we can assist you on that. Rian and I, uh, Clint Gladly, assist you in many divisions across many organizations. Um, yeah, thanks, Shay. The shooting ranges. Welcome to the man's den. These two are must, and you got all of them. I guess uh, so. We're going to Ross here, it's a lever action, and uh, we're going to talk about it inside. I'll introduce you guys to Adrian, uh, the coach inside, so let's get going. So you can go ahead and hang your target off the knot. Uh, guys, let me introduce. This is Adrian. Uh, the coach uh, in the gun range. Hi, Adrian. Please. Hello, man. I'm going to be your instructor today. Yeah. Yes, thank you. All right. So I'm going to show you how to use this Rossi lever action. Um, gun's safe and empty right now, but I'm going to run you through how to operate it and how to operate it safely. Right? Okay, so first and foremost, you're always going to treat it with the utmost respect. This is a dangerous weapon. You need to, whether it's loaded or not loaded, always keep it pointing in a safe direction. Always treat it as though it is dangerous, yeah? So within a gun range, we observe the backstop, the direction that we're going to be shooting in as our safe direction. Always keep it pointing out there. And as much as possible, keep your finger off of the trigger. You only really want to touch your trigger when your sights are on target in order to fire. The rest of the time, leave it alone as much as possible and prevent you from accidentally shooting when you don't mean to. Now, our safe position is going to be that with the <coughs> handle open 
and the bolt to the rear. Uh, but in order to load this gun, we're gonna have to close the handle so that we can feed rounds in through that little falling plate. Sorry, the bag had a mud in it. <laughs> you can cuss it out. That was me, actually. Pardon? That was me, actually. All right. <clears throat> So this is the rounds we're going to be shooting today. These are uh, little 38 specials. Uh, this being a Rossi 357, it can take either 38s for a lighter target load or 357s for other <coughs> purposes. You're going to take the round, you're going to place it on that little plate right there. Right there, press down and all the way forward until it clicks into that tube. Now, you've got a magazine tube under your barrel and you can fit eight rounds in that tube before you get started. So keep following it up with more rounds in case you didn't catch the first one. You wanna press down on that plate, push it all the way forward until it allows that little release plate to come back up. Now, from that point, I'm gonna push this little handle forward, pull it back, which will put it around in the chamber and it's then ready to fire. Now, you can line up your sight. To do so by putting that front sight in the notch that is your rear sight. Uh, keep the tops of them nice and flat with each other. Your left hand goes here on the foregrip. Your right hand stays in that little handle right there. The stock goes against your shoulder and your cheek goes against the stock. So you can look down those sides, line them up in the middle of the target and then squeeze the trigger until it shoots. It'll shoot once for every time you reload it and pull the trigger until it's empty. When it's empty, Yeah, we'll take a couple of floaties. When it's empty, you're gonna leave it on the table with your little handle open just like that, so that I can immediately see that that gun is safe and clear. You'll notice there's no round in the mag, nor is there a round in the chamber. Lay it down, weapon safe, and start the process again. Thank you.